We've got Christian Porter having yesterday resigned from Parliament, which will be effective at the next election. So what will this mean for a crucial seat and what's expected to be a very tight election? The seat of Pearce is held by a bit more than 5% at the moment after a redistribution. We've got our reporter Holly Edwards-Smith on the scene there in Perth. Holly, you've been speaking to some voters. What have their thoughts been? I'm here in Ellenbrook, which is just on the boundary of the Pierce electorate, which Christian Porter has held since 2013. Now, it's still her early here in WA, but I've been speaking to a few locals, some of which on camera and some of which off, and the reviews really have been mixed about how they feel with Christian Porter saying he won't recontest the next federal election. Let's hear from a few of the people I spoke to this morning. Oh, well, I wouldn't say it's his, his choice of what he's in his decision of what he's made in it and I think people must respect his privacy in that and at the end of the day if he wants to be involved in politics so be it if he doesn't he wants to go into private life people must accept that and whatever happened with the donations it's what he's got to live with that conscience and Some of the locals I spoke to off camera have said that they're not surprised he's made this decision because of the backlash and controversy he's faced, particularly in the last 12 months, particularly around the ABC defamation case. Uh, another gentleman said he's glad that Christian Porter won't be recontesting the next election, but really a, a few people here as well like to stay out of politics. They've been telling me that they don't like to listen too much to what the media has to say and we're waiting to see what would happen obviously after those allegations were raised earlier in the year and, and they really just like to watch what the people, their members do for the community here in Western Australia and they're very interested to see who the Liberals put forward uh, for the division of peers and obviously who Labor put forward to run against them in the coming federal election. Yeah, we'll see who the Liberals select. Uh, Tracy Roberts for the Labor Party. Uh, a local mayor for some 10 years, so uh, she's uh, out there campaigning already. Might be a bit of an advantage. Holly, thank you.